Hi, I be you learning here once again with you with some new and useful tutorials. In today's video, I am going to show you how you can make your local Revit model in central model and you can assign the work sets of the elements. So here I will go to open tab and I can open one local model what I have a small sample project. Here you can see I have one model with some floors, railings, walls. So here I will go to the collaboration tab and I will click on the collaboration. Once you will click it will show ok I will save the model and continue. So it's showing that the option will come collaboration with your network or in BIM 360 documents. So here I am just going to save in my computer or maybe in the uh, office server network. So if you assign any server or any place where you can put uh, want to use this uh, central model you can choose that. Now I use within, uh, within your network. So I will select OK. Then I will go to save. Click save. So once you will save, you will see this one is showing that green. This is active. So now it's become a central model. You will go to close this model. Now I will go to again open the model. You will see the same model. Again I am going to open this. This is option is active now. It's showing that you want to detach from the central or create a new local. Once this is the your main file, it is located either in your computer or on the server. So here I have the main file, I just open, it will create a new local. So after opening you will see this is active and you can work with this model as a local user and it will once you will save and, and you can use this synchronize option. So it will be saved here. Now for the work set, I will click here. You will see this is the work set. Now I will go to add the new work set. Before doing this, I will show you what the work set required here. We have some walls, we have railing and here some stair and also floor. So I have four work set to assign here. Now I will go to assign walls. Ok, you can see the walls is assigned here. Then I will go to say slab. Next, I will go to assign railing. And then next, a stair. So the naming you can give as per your company standard or as per your discipline if you are working as architectural with the architectural field you can write here or you can see always AR wall if you are working as a structure with the structure company they always assign ST or STR for a structure wall or uh, column if you are working as a facade company glazing company they can assign like a FC facade. So this is up to you. I just saw how you can do it. So now I keep wall, slab, railing and stair. And now I can click OK. It is showing do you want to make a stair works the active work stair uh, work set? I can keep OK. 
so it is showing here a steer whatever the active this is showing here now how you can assign this i'll go to select this wall select entire wall all wall selected three we have i just made three wall first and then if you will go to identity data you will find the work set here and you have to select it from here so i'll just select wall okay now i will do same for the railing i just go to select all the railings and then the frame same from the railing properties i will just go to the work set and i will change it like a railing okay then i will do this one while you are working you have always this is the best practice to keep all the element on the proper work set to use it properly so for the slab i will check it slab and now the last one is for the stair i just go to select this all stair and then i will put it in on a stair so this is the work set how you can you already assign how you can check it you will click here and now you want to show only you want to show only the slabs okay so i just closed all the select all close and i want to just open this slab so i'll click open and i click okay see here i have only slab so what works it works it is very powerful tool to filter the required so here you can use this one assign and you can filter open all you don't want to show the railing close this and this is here like this now you can save the save your project just go to synchronize synchronize the uh, your uh, local user model to the central file and relinquish all the element so it will be no more you are uh, you will be no more owner of this and then you can save it and close it thanks for watching please subscribe for upcoming videos thank you